database allows you to find a lot of company information, um, a lot of consumer information, but we're going to focus on the U.S. Jobs and Internships section here. So when we click, it defaults to the quick search where you can type in a specific keyword or job title and a city, state, or zip code. So this is kind of if you're just doing a general search. For instance, if I wanted to work in marketing somewhere in Wisconsin, I could do, do that. And when I hit view results, it's going to retrieve all of the jobs that deal with marketing in Wisconsin that are open right now. This is probably going to retrieve a lot of results because it is so general. So if you're not exactly sure what you want to do, where you want to work, this can be a really good option. Because you can see I got a thousand results. So that gives me a lot of options as I'm looking through all of these job listings. If I want to know a little bit more about each job, so let's say I wanted to do this software solution sales representative job, I can click the job title and it will either take you to the company's homepage or to indeed.com where you can read a little bit more about the job description, what qualifications are needed, different things like that. After you've learned a little bit about the job, it's a good idea to figure out a little bit of information about the company. And so we can click the company name here and this will open up a new tab which explains where they're located. Um, it's going to list all of the jobs they have open. So this particular company has quite a few positions open right now. We are going to see a brief profile description and below that you can see how big this organization is. They have about 50 employees, um, approximately how much their sales volume is. If we go down even further you can get the names of the people who are in management. And you can also get an idea of how much they're spending. Um, so some of the bigger line items on their budget, um, how much they spend in terms of payroll, um, in advertising. So this can give you an idea of how big this company is, um, how much business they're doing, different things like that. And you can use these numbers to compare between a couple companies. I'm going to jump back to my search now. Um, and you can either click the revise search button if you want to try a couple new keywords. Um, or we can go to New Search, which is what I'm going to do because I want to show you this custom search option. So we click that custom search tab. You can still do a keyword search, but you can also look for jobs that are from a specific company. You can look for a specific job type, so if you only want part-time work or if you're looking for an internship. You can also look for a specific salary range or a given location. Let's say I'm not concerned with location right now. I just want to work for Walmart and I'd like an internship. So when I go to view results, it's going to retrieve all of the internship opportunities that Walmart has available. And it sometimes takes a little while to load because it's going through a lot of information. You can see I got 188 results. And these are going to be in different locations. Um, Bentonville, Arkansas is the headquarters, and so that's where a lot of these are. But there are some more local ones um, rather than the headquarter location. So you could look for something in a specific city if you want. But again, you can just click on the title to get some information about the job itself. Or you can click company name in order to find out a little bit about that particular company. So if you are interested in using the library resources for conducting, starting the job search, this is a great place to start because it centralizes two of the key aspects, which is finding jobs and finding out a little bit of information about those companies. If you have further questions, you should check out the preparing for the job search guide that I've created and the link is on the screen. Or you should get in touch with Career and Leadership Development. They will post a variety of jobs and internships on their Hawk Jobs website. And they also have career advisors available to talk to you one-on-one. -on -one. And so please don't hesitate to use these resources if you are going through the job search process.